right. Well, we're back at the Vegas Junkies. We've got a special guest today. Yes, we do. Hello, hello. Lacey K. Hello. Summers. Hello, guys. How are hello. You? Yes. Hi. It's crazy. <laughs> I think when I first met you, you had. Sit, you're probably sick of talking about this, but you have to do it anyway. Uh, I want to say you had six million followers when I first met you on Instagram, and now you are wow. ten million strong and counting. Yes. How do you do that? I can't. That is I have a impressive girl. What? Ten million. I try. Understand sure. this though, okay? You had six million when I met you, and that's maybe what has it been? Ago. Three years? Four years? Three? I think so. It like longer. It does, but That's I feel like, like it's only life. three. 2016. <laughs> so 2016, three okay. years ago. Okay. okay I can't do so that. three so years ago, doing that for me. <laughs> you had six million followers. Mm -hmm. Now you have ten million. Three years ago, I had like wow. eighteen hundred, and now I have twenty two hundred. What yeah. am I doing wrong? I mean, you don't have boobs, number one. Can I get them? <laughs> I might have to get them. If that's all it takes, I'm willing to get them at yeah. this point. No, I think I, we both I, know some doctors. We can send your way. <laughs> no, I think it's just. It's so many things. It's because they change up the algorithm all the time and they change up everything. So now what they're doing is like only 10% of your followers actually even see your stuff. So I think you just really have to, it's all content based. It's interacting with your followers because followers don't equal fans. It's doing giveaways. It's engaging. It's caring about them. It's doing certain posts at certain times. It's posting on your story. It's just so many things under that umbrella of just engagement and social media. That really does matter. Yeah. Every little thing. Yeah. It's crazy. And have you spent, like, obviously you've been on Instagram since, like, pretty much the first month or whatever, right? And so, like, you just have it down to a sign. Is it, it's not just that you're hot and you have this look. No. It's you have the yeah. formula down to a science. It's true. Is that what it is? It's true. And it's always changing. So then you have to make sure you're changing with it because, like, what you did last year is not going to work this year. Right. And, and then it's also, like, it's the funds, it's paying for advertising too on the right pages and switching up your content, making it interesting, like the coloring, it's all of that stuff. Like it's very, very important. And when you say Instagram changes it up, it's not like you don't get an email from them no. that says, Hey, I was just gonna ask dear you, how do you how do you know? Dear you just user, kind of you just have to, it up. Yeah, you just have to figure out and be like, Whoa, okay, well that's not working anymore. So you kinda of just have to go with it and throw out whatever you think and just see what sticks and So like you'll post a pic or a video and it won't like perform as well as it normally does. Mm -hmm. And then you go, it's one of two things. It's either they just didn't like that piece of content or right. more likely it's, oh, Instagram, yeah. you threw me a curveball. Yeah. Is that what happens? Yeah, it's like, yeah. And then I feel like, okay, well, what time did I post? Like, was it like, what was going on? Okay, like what was wrong with this? Um, or just look at the engagement of how they're like interacting with it. So. You, you are going to post content that's like true to yourself too that you probably it's not always an ass pick you know like for my music for example so you have to like kind of get that out there right and some people might not be as like willing to take to stuff like that and you kind of still have to post what what's you and what feels like you too and then mix in the other stuff so it might just happen too just because but yeah it's a big process now i've never tried that you just gave me an idea i've never tried an ass pick for me like is that, <laughs> oh, is that is that what I'm doing one. wrong? You is know that what? We maybe get one on. we could teach you right? how to pose and the angle. right angle like me and a thong the on the angle. beach or something and like exactly. boom oh. twenty six hundred followers or in a diaper you know in a di yeah I've done the diaper Vegas. yeah the diaper yes, actually works that's what of. took me from eighteen to two you know <laughs> yeah I know me in a diaper yeah I would all love, you gotta do is I dare him to do something and he'll do it yeah. <laughs> it's, you gotta come up there has to be a dare or something like yeah he doesn't turn down dares yeah I don't seem to bad judge Going through. Oh, yeah. it's gonna happen. Every time you I bet on Conor McGregor, he loses, <laughs> and that's what that it costs me. <laughs> yeah, Done. I love Conor. Yeah. So I'm curious, like, what was the light bulb moment for you when you like started posting? You're like, this is what I have to do. Uh, like back then, yeah. To, like get it going. I was well. I think it's also a little bit unfair because I was one of the first ones on Instagram. So I kind of hit hit it when the algorithm was good and they did chronological order. So when I did that, I was like paying for shouts. I was working with companies. I would trade with people, and that helped. And then being one of the first ones on there and getting all those initial followers, and then all the other people came in afterwards. Like, oh, we can do this too. Blah blah blah. But it was kind of like, well, the original people kind of already were there and did it. Right. So now it is a little bit harder. But yeah, it's just. I've always wanted to model and sing. Singing has always been my end goal, but I was like, God, I don't want a regular job. I want to be able to work for myself. I didn't, like, I wasn't really, like, I was good in school, but I just didn't like being around people, so I ended up being homeschooled. So I was like, I want to do a job that I can do, like, from home and make my own schedule. That's everybody's dream, right? Yeah. So 100%. I just kind of went with it, and it started off really good because I got supplement contracts, like, right away. 
and I did the whole fitness thing, still kind of do, and then I switched to the modeling thing, and then I switched to like the music thing, not really switched to, but I just kind of integrated. Yeah, it just came with it. Yeah, so I just, I always kind of knew I wanted to do it, and my family was super supportive, mm -hmm. and I was always good about like, okay, I need a nice camera, I need the best lighting, I need coloring, like a lot of people didn't really care about that back then, they just kind of posted, but I was always like, I overthink and overanalyze everything, so everything has to be like perfect. Well, you are your brand, so you have to <laughs> make true. it perfect. Yeah, 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 I like true. that you just said that, because I think a lot of people just think it was dumb luck, or yeah. it was no. right, or, or she's just hot. right, so but like yeah, you, no. you really were calculated. It's in, a full-time in, job. It is, it's a job, mm -hmm. career, yeah, it is. And. Do you remember like back when you first started on Instagram, like how fast did you get to like 10,000? Like, do you remember like, did that come quick or? Uh, it wasn't as quick because I was posting a lot of ads, I think, and that kind of maybe wasn't as good. Got it. But then I was like, okay, so how do I still post these and make my money, but also not be so like salesy? Right. And so then I just kind of had to figure out that posting more, like back then I was posting probably four times a day, you know, compared to now, it's like not that much. And so you just kind of had to, Put, like a good balance between the two and why do you not post as much i notice like you post on story pretty much mm -hmm. continually but not on your uh what do they call it the grid the, or the feed or what yeah, is I that called timeline or the timeline yeah okay. i i have been, like it's again the trial and error so you're trying to figure out like oh okay so you know what's going on with instagram here so what i like to do now is i just really like engagement's important to me not just like posting something and being like oh that's cute cool moving on i really like to engage with people so i do the giveaways i want them to see the content i want them to know right it's kind of hard to see who you are through a picture and they judge you know a lot of people in life they everybody can. they judge so they're just like oh cool she's whatever because you look a certain way so i really like to be on my stories because i can just be totally myself right and i can like be real and down to earth and talk how I want to talk and be how I want to be but like as for Instagram people are like oh why don't you post pictures on makeup why don't you do this it's because it's a science mm -hmm. and you have to do it a certain way to make money to create that brand to do you know certain things so right. a lot of people don't understand that whole deal and now I just read that but like story people underestimate this the eyeballs on story like mm -hmm. there's like it's something like I want to say 400 million active daily on the stories on the stories That's that I've insane. read yeah and you know what's funny is a lot of people who view my stories don't even follow me either. I like that. So they're people. Well, those are haters? I see, yeah, I guess. Well, also fans probably a little bit. Just a little bit. Um, Married guys that, that are not allowed to follow women. you? Like, like fashion bloggers. Like they're too good to like follow. I don't want to commit to it. Yeah. But oh, that's interesting. I'm just like, girl, you're on my story every <laughs> single day. You must like something you so, see. I like that you look. So, so you actually go back and you look. Yeah. And just, well, I can't see everyone. But you can see like the top people, and I'm pretty sure those are the people that view it every day because I see like the little circles, you know, on the bottom, and I'm like, I see your face again, girl. How many views do you get in a story? Oh, it depends. Like, if I'm not posting a lot or if I'm posting too much, I like people to turn on their post notifications too, which helps. Yeah. So, and sometimes I don't like to overpost, but I can get anywhere from like 800 to a million, probably. For each story a post, story. or like if it's like a Saturday, maybe. And that's I'll get within like 24 less. hours because it goes away, right? Yeah. So within 24 mm -hmm. hours of you posting something on Story, you can get 800,000 to a million eyeballs on it. Yeah. And it actually shows you that, so you, yeah. like, you're not even guessing. It shows, it, you. it shows you. Yeah, and then sometimes less, like on holidays or weekends or whatever. Sometimes if people post a lot, people are like, okay, I'm not going to follow their stories like anymore. So sometimes they're like, you post too much. I'm like, okay, I'm sorry. Like system sorry. overload. We're, yeah. we, we got it. We're good. Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. Good for you, man. I don't know if Million. you remember this or if you even know this, but so Chad sent me a screenshot around Super Bowl earlier this year, February, like January, February. Bowl? Yeah. Okay. Of your weekly uh, impressions. Oh, it did. was, and I'm sure it's gone up because your followers have gone up, right? So, but back then, this was like the week of, I want to say, right around the Super Bowl time. Mm -hmm. It was 86 million impressions a week. A <laughs> hundred million people That's watch nice. the Super Bowl. You had 86 million people that, a week. But they don't all follow me. Does that freak you out though? Doesn't uh, that freak you out sometimes? No, that I some love people it. people are watching you. I love like it. Like complete strangers. All eyes on me. I love it that way. <laughs> I love it. Okay. It's always something I've always wanted. Like I've always wanted, you know, and I just, I love it. But yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot. Cause I'm like, wait, why are y'all staring at me but not following me? What's yeah. happening? But I get like a lot of guys that have girlfriends or girls that like, don't like have too much pride, you know, and they can't follow like other pretty girls because they don't support other people, which is sad, you know, yeah. but so 
And now I have a new respect for you recently in like the last six months as I've grown Lacey from 1800 to 2200 or it might even be 23, 2400 mm -hmm. by now for all I know because it's just mm -hmm. by the second. You can't keep up. Look at this face. It's, you can't it's, keep it's up. It's climbing. <laughs> I have haters now. Oh, yeah. And it bugs me. What? Uh, How man. Do, you do they comment? Uh, yeah, I get comments, so I get, you know, as you know, Vanessa, Pine Size Warrior, yes. is, there's a little bit of an age gap. <laughs> no. And uh, they're, they're, they're not afraid to let me or her know it, that they're aware of it. Are you serious? Yeah. That's the worst one so, you got. I mean, it's, it's... Pretty bad. I mean, I've been Just called, trolls. yeah, old, uh, you know... Balding, but who are the people uh, saying this though? Just random. Strangers. A lot of followers on her. Or they can't have her, then want her. Right, uh -huh. right. Yes. And then just a lot of like just random guys that don't know either of us, and I don't even think they follow her. I'm pointing because she's back there. Yeah. Um, uh, <laughs> she's our audience. You know, yeah. <laughs> just uh, random, random people mm -hmm. that that just want to hate. You know, but whatever. They have nothing else to do. It's well, so yeah. sad. I'll get someone will send me DMs, be like, you're, you're. Girlfriend, uh, oh, I see you post those sometimes. Should, yeah, so sometimes funny. I call them out. You know, she's like, You <laughs> have no business me. getting that. Yeah. Plus, your father's washed up, dude, and oh, you're balding. Wow. Like, yeah, like, whatever. Oh, like, God. wow. You're like, Hey, we're still living our life. Right, but, so, it, so, how do you not let that, like, what you must deal with, what I'm complaining about? Compared to what you must deal with, and you probably get it too. Or you, you oh, said yeah. you have nice people. I have nice, nice people, people that fall. I don't. Get kind She's of right. good group. I don't know. Right? Good group. I don't know what vibes I'm putting out there, and I'm gonna keep doing yeah. it. But they yeah. love it. I don't get anything. You know, but like I, I'm good. all off vibes too, and energy. Yeah. I love people off energy. Like no matter what they look like or whatever, you know, you know, like when you walk into a room, sometimes you just don't even like someone. You don't know why. It's just the energy. It is right. Energy. All about energy. Like mm -hmm. looks have nothing to do with it. It's mm -hmm. all about the energy and the vibe. And yeah, and I, I like that I you're get so creepy people like saying like good get morning, creepy. beautiful. Can we like have some like meet up for drinks? Oh my god, I get those, but I don't creepy get. Ones? I don't. Get like haters, like people saying like. That's good. Vanessa, or, Vanessa gets people that want pics of her feet. Do you oh, get this? Yeah. What is that's with like the a, feet? I feel like that's a new thing. Let me see yeah. up. Let me see up. Yeah. <laughs> you better sell those pictures, girl. <laughs> I have the worst tan lines on my feet. I don't think you want my feet. Yeah, pictures. I. I like you don't question. have any feet fetish, oh, folks. I, oh, yeah. oh, you do. You have everything. Oh, You've got. You I've name got it. One negative comments. Too. I've got one. I'm not one of those. What? <laughs> and you still have the last time you did our you did our action junkie show way back when mm -hmm. you're a champ i mean you I you i love that you you come on board when we have no listeners <laughs> yes it's amazing and i can't thank you enough for that um i remember you had at the time you had a handful of celebrities that slide into your dm you didn't name yeah. names but are you still do you still is there a whole new crop there's sliding so into the DM? Many. Is there's it mostly so athletes? Many. Is what I would athletes, guess. Athletes, it's like rappers. It's just all it's all the same, honestly, according to <laughs> Are any of them creative or are they all pretty like no, basic? No, like, hey, absolutely not. Hey Ma, what's up? Yeah, it's the like, same thing. Yeah. And I go on their page, I'm like, you have a wife. Wow. What? You have a girlfriend. Like what? And you know, there's some girls that will just oh my god, well I got to be with so and so, so they don't care. Or some girls don't care. It's, it's right. story. I could never yeah. it's weird because you look at me and they're like, Oh, she yeah. must be no, I have. If I'm in a relationship, I'm in a relationship. Like, I don't, I don't know. I can't. I just right. can't. I cannot. And I don't really care. I mean, I've worked with so many celebrities. You know, you have to. It's not. Sure. You get to that point where it's like they're a person too. Right. You're not right. like starstruck. You're not like, oh my god. Like some people are. It's yeah. Just, right. And it's all about the energy. Do you, when it's rappers, do they dangle the carrot of like, hey, let's collab, let's they do it? They don't a, even. Do they don't that. even do that. But I do that. Rappers, I'm what like, are you doing, rappers? Oh, come on, get the program. Come on. Yeah, I just, they they don't. And I'm like, oh, well, maybe we can get in the studio and do whatever. And they're just like, yeah. I'm like, no, you're such a liar. <laughs> but now I've been working with Master P a little bit. And it's kind of cool to have him in my corner. Because then yeah, I can be like, oh. Kind of and they cool. And they respect. Well, it's, yeah. it's know, very cool. Yeah. It's kind of cool. In the just way, a legend. Yeah. Yeah. No <laughs> big deal. Legend. But in the way yeah. of, like, they'll respect me. Like, if I kind of pull that card a little bit, like, oh, OK. Right, okay. right. It's like you trump them. You know, yeah. it's like, yeah. I got Master P, yeah. bitch. Uh, don't yeah. worry about me. <laughs> exactly. Uh, so how is music going? Like I, I think what you, I watched you progress. Like 
I loved you started off you were like posting covers and stuff mm -hmm. um, like you know a couple years ago or whatever and then you had started with the original music but now I feel like you've even taken it from just doing original music yeah. in the studio to like you just did a performance in yeah. LA the two. other night my second one. oh two yeah. okay yeah um, you looked amazing like the, I love the I don't know like did you get a the stylist aesthetic? for that or no, like what, how I did that myself, did you kicked it up crazy. you clearly took it up a notch uh -huh. how did you do all this you know I've tried to style this before and I just never understood like I can dress myself and I like like to do it so I never really understood that whole concept but yeah I just kind of had a vision of like kind of what I wanted and I was searching for it and I had it like kind of pretty much custom made and it's just I kind of just know like the vibe I want to go and I have my makeup artist and my hair artist they help me I'm like here's my ideas like what do you think they're very talented so they kind of go on that and then I play off of it and it's just it's so much fun and I finally feel like I'm living where I'm supposed to live and it and it was cool because we saw Chris Angel last night and he had like this little speech about like it took him 18 years or something right. and I'm like okay and he's like it doesn't happen on your time it happens on just the timing like it's right. not your timetable and I was right. like I know I'm crying yeah. <laughs> big believer in that yes. big believer in I'm that I'm just like I, it's All true you have to life. keep telling yourself that yeah Yep. We know whenever you do, whenever you get to the next level of like the national Lacey K tour, you know, um, Natalie here is a really good dancer. I'm just, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not dance, saying you're yeah. obligated to take her on the dance. road with you. I'm not I saying, you know, you're on this I'm just saying like, mm -hmm, you better be careful because right. I'm very loyal. So you're going to be around you know, for a long time. Hey girl, I'm going to some dancers. I got, she's got you. Latin fire going yeah, on. Yeah, you know I mean? it's so, got the dark hair contrast yeah. with the light, mm -hmm. you know? Exactly. exactly. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You know. You like Still that? Put you on the yeah. spot. Yeah. There you yeah. 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 You know, she's wanting to go on tour with Pitbull, but you know, uh, I'm just yeah. saying. But his crew's like solidly locked in. Yeah. Yeah. So. You know. yeah. Yeah. So now we gotta find my. Solid we gotta crew. find okay. his, exactly. And yeah. so I yeah. saw you were on the Breakfast Club recently. Yeah. So that was cool, and you were out promoting. Like, so how did yes. how did it's it's probably hard for you to get your challenge is like. Breaking through in the music business is just hard for anyone, mm -hmm. right, when you're new. Doing it through social media, there's a lot of competition, but then I think, I feel like you have to like jump with like a lot of people that think would be something that would be a positive, might be a negative at first for you is you have to earn the yeah. respect, right? Mm -hmm. Because they judge you off of, right. oh, you're Instagram famous right. or, or whatever. Well, it's funny because they say, well, do you have anything better to do than post a butt pic? And then I have like, you know, I actually have music and I'm talented and I do yeah, this and they're well, like, oh, we'll stick to Molly. It's like, well, which one right, is it? Right, You can't get to break, yeah, right? Yeah, you gotta pick one. There's always gonna be somebody. But yeah, it's just breaking that. And I feel like it might not ever be broken because even J-Lo, as amazing as she is, still has people that hate her too. And I'm like, how? Yeah. Like, you're perfect. Right. <laughs> you know? So it's, it's, you're always gonna have that. And I've had it at a young age, I guess. I just kind of develop thick skin I guess yeah but yeah you do have to break through of the whole like modeling thing I mean that's cool and that was like pay the bills and it's cool to say I did but it's never been my like real passion right it's work you know right and I, I just had to and you basically to used money. it as a vehicle to get hopefully to this yes. right well, you've, yes. you've gotten to this and, and now it's funny because I do I have a lot of love on my music and then I have some hate but people within the industry, like the Master P's and some of the rappers that are my friends, like they're all like, your music is good. And I'm like, well, I trust your judgment because you're in the music business, sure. you know? And yeah. And, and I would think they're too busy to blow smoke. Yeah, they like, don't need to. They yeah. don't need to. Exactly. Right. Yeah. They've and sold platinum records. Them. Like they don't need to waste time yes. on you. And, and, and they know that they understand the challenge of crossing you right. over from like Instagram model, whatever right. you want to call it, influencer to legit respected recording artists. Yeah. Like they... And it's hard. I mean, I don't think people understand. Like, there's a lot of money that goes into it. Yeah. You have to find producers. You have to find engineers. People have to mix it. You have to find the right mastering. Like, people have to understand with the songwriting. Right. Like, it's so hard to find that, you know, that person. I think I've I've pretty much found like my engineers and stuff that I work with now all the time, just because like I'm a loyal person and yep. I just like to do that. Yeah. But it's not easy, and it's no. definitely not cheap. <laughs> right. And you know, when you're not signed to a label, exactly, you are the label you're the now, own label. right? You front the the cost for marketing and music videos, and I mean, I, I spend way too much on those, but it's fun and it's experience for me and. I don't really want to do things half-assed because I feel like because I'm coming from the modeling world, I don't want them to be like, oh yeah, see, told you. Like, it has to be really good and like produce really well for them to be like, okay, right? maybe I can't really judge that because, yeah. you know, I have to just keep up with that. 
Yeah. Stamina. I don't know if you got to see the clip that she posted from her show from the other night on Instagram or not, but like the production, like it's oh, it I, ain't no, cheap I, what I she's stopped. talking about. I stopped a little yeah. before we yeah. met up for yeah. sure. Yeah. I needed to know. I'm like, Ooh, I need she to got know. Research. I was she like knows. researching. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> do you write your own music? How does that I come write along? some of it. I do have writers. I'm just very ADHD. I know what I like kind of want to say. And yeah. I just kind of blurt it out, and then they like put it into the form. And then they take over. I cannot sit down and, and do all of that. I'm just over here, and I'm over here, and I'm over here, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I'm bouncing off walls. But I do have people help me like structure it and put it in, and I do have songwriters and stuff. And even with the setup with the music, like we wanted to make sure it was like there's lighting, there's smoke, there's dancers, there's right. the DJ, there's the backdrops with it plays all the visuals, right. there's the, there's video. And so who does all that? Like, do you hire an actual director for the videos, or like because that's Music pricey videos, too, yeah. Like, yeah. Yes, they're very pricey. And so, I've how do you overspent. find them? <laughs> so, I are you happy with the way they come out, though? Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah, I am. Uh, I'm a perfectionist, but that's kind of why. Because he did my first one, and I was like, okay, I'm obsessed. Yeah. But again, he is very good, and he does a lot of like celebrities and stuff. So I have to, you know, you kind of have to sacrifice a little bit and pay what that. Right. Yeah, I tell them the vision, or sometimes I'm like, I'm totally like stumped. What do you think you see? And then like we'll kind of work off each other. But for the last one for role play, we wanted to kind of reverse the roles a little bit and do it a little bit different. And it was totally my idea and my managers. He came up with it too, and we just went off of it. And he's like, I like that. So we just went with it. We actually used my house for location, which oh, is kind of wow. cool. Well, that helps too. Yeah, we got, yeah, we got budget this time. And yeah, it's just, it's so much fun. That's probably one of my favorite things to do besides performing on stage. But. And now you're living solely in LA now? Like I know you bounced around, yeah. you were in LA, then you were in Arizona, and now you're, yeah. you're back in LA uh -huh. like full time. Full time. Are, yeah. you, are you liking it? Did you miss I it? Or? I do. Well, I was in Orange County, which is a little bit like more low key. Orange County girl. I, I love Orange County. Yeah. But then it's like my work is in LA, and my acting classes are in LA, and my stunt training is in LA, and, and my, my coaches are in LA, so it's like, it doesn't make sense to drive every day. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That commute is not fun. No, yeah. I've done it's it. not fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no and I and I try to dabble into a bunch of things, so it's not just strictly, you know, music. I'm doing like the acting thing too, and getting on that, and just there's so much that goes into it. People don't get it. Even I didn't understand. I was like, I'm gonna be an actress, and then I'm like breaking the script down, and you're doing scenes, and you're right. like figuring That's out all these things and why you're saying what. And I'm like, oh my right. god, this is not yeah. easy. I wanted not. to skip to the fun part. <laughs> <laughs> and again, it's that same challenge, right? It's like mm -hmm. now, maybe even harder than the music, yeah. right? Because at least the music. They go, okay, well, you've got the following. Right, so as long as the music is decent, yeah. you make sense. And the music's way past decent. Right, I mean, you, yeah. Your music acting, holds up. Like, like, music is, you're, you're the character, too. That's I won't, the persona you pers yeah, yeah. put out. I won't name the name, but I text you a week or two ago. I went to a concert, yeah. and I couldn't believe the opening act who has a, like, I don't, I don't think it's a number one song, but it's certainly in the top oh, yeah. 10, I think, that, that one song. I'm not going to say, uh -huh. I don't want to say, but... Uh, it was awful. This girl was awful. Like, it's not even, and I'm not a hater. Like, I'm not. Right. It was, uh, you were at the same concert, as a oh, matter of fact, sitting was, behind me. I was, yeah. So the opening, I, I didn't know it at the time. I was trying yeah. to guess. Okay, so the opening Picking act. Picking up what you're putting down. Yeah, well, we yeah, got yeah. there kind of late, but. Oh, um, I, didn't, I didn't come. I got there just for. Oh, you got there just for Ellie. Sure. So now that I. You ruined Did it. I screw that <laughs> yeah. up? Was well, the opening act being the first number I saw? There were artists before, before that. that. <laughs> Are you talking about her performance or the one? No, before? Ellie was great. Oh, she killed it for those. Four I'm minutes. not talking about the one before. I'm talking about even prior to that. No, I, I got there just. Okay. I worked at the pool. We'll talk exhausted. offline. But and then I just went for. I was for her. I was mad. I was literally Isn't sitting with Vanessa. Crazy? I'm texting you mad, and I even think I sent you some clips or you something. Think you're mad. I'm even more. Yeah, mad. no, I get I it. <laughs> Because I'm like, you know, it's also about, I feel like it's who people know. Because even yeah. these people on social media, they have a lot of followers. They're not good. Maybe they want to do it. Maybe they're just doing it for fun or whatever. But they know people. So, But yeah. even with that, I'm confused. Like, is it, what am I missing? You got 10 million followers. Yeah. If you look at any of your videos, they get anywhere from, I don't know, 700,000 on a bad video. 700,000 people. Okay? Just yeah. FYI. 800,000 watch Fox News. Just FYI. Wow. 700,000 watch your video. Yeah. So just think of it like that, yeah. okay? It's a lot of people. Yeah. The good ones, or whatever, the ones that get more right. attention, are over a million. Yeah, two. Within three days. Yeah. Like, it's like a TV show. How does not everyone, much. anyone much. in the music business, like, what are you guys doing? Hello? Like, doing? Hello. do not just do the math and go, we need to put her. Yeah. Like, you should have been the one that I saw opening. I mean, I could even argue a case. I mean, Ellie's had hit after hit after hit. Yeah. But like, 
you belong in that, in that realm. one of the Thank three you. that opened for yes. Ellie. Like, how does it I... not make sense? Like, I feel like even Ellie would go, mm-hmm. yeah, no brainer. Hello. Yeah. Like, yeah. piggyback. Like, yeah. ride the wave. Yeah. Ride the Lacey K wave. Mm-hmm. No? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What did I miss? Why aren't they doing that? When is that's the mystery? It's the mystery. That's the mystery. Yeah. And I feel like I'm doing it so much on my own. And then I'll have like some people come in and like do whatever. But I feel like the people always come in in the end when like all the hard shit's done and they're like, cool, now we can like, you know, so I'm right. like, yeah, I know. They don't want to be there they for the struggle. They want the finished product yes. and then they'll come and, and they'll I take, know and we'll take 20%. Happen, but when, exactly, <laughs> exactly. But way. when is the question and it's yeah. like, oh right. my goodness. It's like, I feel like I'm just so anxious. Right. Because I have, like, I've been practicing my dancing. I've been in rehearsal. I've been, yeah. I've done everything I need to do except for just, well. Yeah. How many shows have yeah. you done? Well, I've only done two so far. Well, three. Two when live I was younger, shows. I opened up for Snoop Dogg and Ice Cube with a friend. It was like that's a good, crazy. That's I was a fun like, story. Yeah. I want to hear that. Story. I like yeah. that she just drops legends as yeah. well. By the way, like, uh, yeah, just Master P and uh, yeah. Snoop. Like, I want to yeah. hear that story. I'm not a name dropper, you guys. Right. <laughs> I didn't say it. <laughs> You're a friend. <laughs> Yeah, so I mean, I, I do. Know, I'm putting in all the work, so when it does happen, I'm like totally ready. Yeah, I just gotta keep going. Because the more you put into yourself, and the more investment you put into yourself, like it's just what goes around comes around. Yeah. The universe knows. Yeah, and like you said though, like you were just a Chris Angel. You said 18 years. You've been at it on Instagram. I know you've been working like your whole even prior to Instagram, but like you know, Instagram yeah. is what five, six years now. Yeah. And music, how long? Realistic, like, to, like to this level, right? But. Uh, to the level you're at right like now, four years, right? Yeah. So I'm not saying yeah. you got you got 14 years to go, but I'm just yeah. saying like yes. you know if you couple yes. that with when you were yes. 13, 14, like uh-huh. you're right, you're there, you're mm-hmm. like you're on the mm-hmm. 10 yard line. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You mm-hmm. just got to go that next 10 yards. Yep, yep, almost there. Yeah, there. I believe. Yes. And so, how do you like Vegas? You are you I a love Vegas. you do love Vegas. And now you're I've here. here. Yeah. You yeah. and Vanessa. Yes. Um, yeah, I love it. I'm not a partier though. I just like right. to go see shows and entertainment. I'm so weird when I see even Chris Angel. I mean, I don't know him personally, yeah. but like he's just up there doing what he loves. I'm like, super nice why guy. Why am I crying right now? <laughs> this is not even anything to cry over. It's weird. Like art makes me not like just art on the wall, but like art as to me is just like performance and stuff. I yeah. cry every time, and I don't know why. It's so like because well, you part- understand the truth. Yeah, because you know. How hard yes. it is to get right. where he's at. Oh my god, yeah. yes. I mean, I'm the same way I get it too. Uh-huh. And then after a show, to my own show, I'm like so high on life for like four or five days, and I'm just like, oh my god. Yeah. And then I like kind of come down a little bit. I mean, it's yeah. like a fix. Like, you want another one. Right. <laughs> like, yeah. right. I need another show. Yeah. Yeah, so you did get that emotional high from yeah. performing live, right? There's yeah. nothing like it. I mean, when I did, so... I still sometimes miss stand up for that exact reason. There's, yeah. It's one thing to do this, and it's fun, and like, yeah. you know, you hope it's funny or parts yeah. of it, or people just like 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 what we're doing Uh but you don't know like you're not there when they're listening in their car or whatever it's like I don't know but like stand up it's instant performing live it's instant you know and there's different levels of you know obviously out of respect you do a song you finish the song they clap it's just the formula but you also know when you nailed it because there's different levels of clapping and screaming and carrying on and you just see in their faces yes or like some people that come all the way up and they like reach their hands off I'm like who am I Britney Spears why do you want to touch me okay (laughs) Do do you know how many people came to see you the other night? I don't know exactly. Um, I think it was around like 3,000. I mean, that's crazy. And that's just from you promoting it and the club promoting it, right? Lazy Key Summers, right? And that's just piggybacking off of your, I'm assuming, obviously you've been putting music on Instagram for yeah. for a little minute now yeah. so people your followers know like right. oh she's good like it's yeah. not just mm-hmm. and I know. had a friend too he's, he does music and he's actually my main choreographer his name's Sean and he um, he helps put on like the shows and stuff and he teaches all my choreography he was actually Cher's choreographer for years again there she goes yeah. again here yeah. we go name again. dropping yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I get I to work with right the best yeah. okay yeah. I'm just gonna ride with this one right <laughs> yeah. so it's fun like I, I pick and choose people and it, it just it happens you know like no one told me like this is what you need to do Lacey like I'm just like okay what do I need to do okay I should right. probably be dancing I should probably be singing I should probably be acting right. my stunt training is super fun I should probably be doing all these things yeah. and then like just kind of figure it out is it hard to sing so my pet peeve is I can't stand when they lip sync I get certain yeah. dancers like if you're really dancing yeah. I get it out. like yeah. if you're full out like, like you can't Beyonce. expect someone just to breathe and sing right. it's just not gonna happen yeah. and I get that Yeah. but I feel like a lot of entertainers abuse that yeah. And just take the, the easy way out. Mm-hmm. Is it hard for you to sing and dance at the Yeah. It is hard. Yes. I have asthma, so my when I'm doing that, it's not oh, very easy. Yeah. It's exercise induced. 
But I do, people, a lot of people do show tracks, so they'll have like the backing vocals and then right. whatever, or certain parts. I was dancing a lot, so my second one, I was still singing over my show track, right. but I was like that I get. certain parts. Yeah, because for me, it's you like, have to. I you love... can't. You can't breathe. Right. Yeah. I mean, you can't yeah. finish. Like I get but it. I, but, but I don't love it. Think yeah, and I love the real stuff to come through. Oh, right. Yeah. At least sing yeah. along on top yes. of it. Yes. Right. Yes. You have to. But for me, it's like I love singing, but I'm more of like a Britney versus Christina. Like I'm more performance based too. So although I love singing and all that, it's just I love the performance part, mm -hmm. and I like to create experience for people. Like I don't want to just go like on stage like right. hey guys look at me like I want I have like a really big lift in my show where they like lift me up and I'm singing like all on a huge bridge like they pick me up on their shoulders like I really love like the visual part too when you say you're more Britney than Christina do you you really just mean because uh, you, you lean towards performing yes, right. but right. you've got the chops to I hope sing so. <laughs> you 100% do I mean not like Christina but no one can really that's another her. level of, that's yeah. a freakish yeah. level but yeah. like you can hang I put yeah. you again yeah. same thing that concert we yes. were both at I won't say any names other than Fury, I said Fury, not Ellie but yes. the, you know the yes. other ones that, I don't know who you were talking about right um, <laughs> I missed it I missed it I will put you up against them yeah. that specific one that I'm yeah. speaking of all day mm -hmm. long every day and yeah. it is not and even also, close I agree it kind of makes me mad that's yeah. why I don't watch those things or like the singing shows or whatever because I'm just like no yeah no, it's no offense but it's right no like, of course I put in so much time and effort and I just feel like that's all you need to get yeah. there right like Music has changed so much since the 90s and 70s. And, and 80s continually. And 50s. It keeps changing. Yeah. I almost it feel like maybe in a not good way. <laughs> not good way sometimes. Yeah. I feel the same way about dance, too. Yeah, it's just so different. Really? You see there's a, a, a it, yeah. different trends, or I don't think. It yeah, it's just very staccato, and like I want to say different words. Please dance. don't use fancy words. No, yeah. I just. I don't even know what Please don't use fancy words. It's very, words. Like, very like, sharp and fast, and just like. Okay, thank you. Very like. I don't not very feel. You don't feel. I know. It's like nobody's feeling. And everyone's just trying to show off, and I don't know. Yeah. I don't like it. There's another word I'm gonna say with my face. <laughs> okay. The C. We're very opinionated table. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and uh, so, what have you done this trip? I know this was kind of a quick trip, but uh, uh, I, it seems like you've Angel? been you've been enjoying the suite uh, <laughs> yes. up in the room here yes. at the Tropicana. Yes. Tropicana. Yeah. yeah. Shout out to Tropicana. Shout out to John. Shout out to life. <laughs> <laughs> I'm walked in there. I'm like, dang! I can see the whole strip. It's like the corner, big window. Yeah. I love big window. They just remodeled this whole That's place, so and they're good. still finishing touches. But like this, the Chago Lounge uh, where we are right now. Yeah. I mean, you could drop this lounge in any casino. I, when you think of like you know, uh -huh. Caesars or the, yeah. the the high end. And I think like it's it's almost like, do you want to go to a club or like a dive bar? I think dive bars are so much cooler because they're more personable. Right. Like, it's so like it's just a vibe. Like, yeah. You don't want the crazy loud like well, I don't know. I mm -hmm. don't anyway. So I just love being in a chill environment. Yeah. Like that's I mean Vegas was not very chill, but you know what I'm saying. And I saw you went to one of my favorite spots last night. You went to Benihana. Benihana. You took me there the first time. So good. Time. That's yes. so crazy. Have I've you been to Benihana there ever? Before until you guys say yes. Us. Yes. Okay. That's yes. Steve Aoki's pop. Yes. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Spot. That's you funny. You and Vanessa took us the first time we came yeah. here. I forgot it was maybe for the first park. I don't remember what it was for. Just for because Which we one? were just in. I never been there. The one on the strip. The new one on the strip that's like at the fashion show mall. It's like just so perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't been to that one yet. But it's so like, good. Sure oh, you've been old school like Hilton old or uh, old Westgate? Uh, Westgate? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you have a three hour <laughs> dinner there. <laughs> yeah, it is. It takes yeah. a long time. And you know there's one in uh, LA too, right? No. There's one in, well, you have to go in the valley. There's one oh. in the Casino. There used to be one in Beverly Hills on La Cienega, yeah. but I think they closed it. I don't get out much. I think. You don't get out much. <laughs> I don't get out much. I don't watch TV. I'm just... Ask her what show she watches. Do you ever watch America's Got Talent? Do you watch it or no? Mm, yes. Even though you had a hater from there, you got blocked Another from there. Another one. What? <laughs> yeah, she doesn't. I'll tell you in a second. Um, uh -oh. So, yeah, she doesn't watch. All right, so I went hard no, on her one. on the Ask last the last, one. last show we did. I was talking about AGT, as we call it. Uh, and uh, she's like, hey, I don't watch America's Got Talent. I don't, I don't oh, watch. Yeah. I got so much. And I said, so what about much... American Idol? Ever? Nothing? No. no. He was so hard on me. What's going on here? I don't understand. It's what... just, it, okay. you know, our lives are in entertainment. Like, we live yes. we live in entertainment. We do okay. our jobs and our careers True. and everything that we do. Which All is right. like, the last thing I want to do is go home and watch it because mm -hmm. I live in it. Yeah. I live in Las Vegas, LA. Okay. And we live so, in it. It's just so TV televised. It's just like, I get it. Know. All she right. gets me. But I get it whatever. from like an outside perspective. Like You're still in the doghouse. I'm gloating right now. <laughs> yeah, whatever. No, I'm very happy I about agree. this conversation. Yeah, I agree. Now he like, what? Yeah. I was like, 
Yeah. So in when you're not posting on social and stuff, what's what's a day in the life of Lacey for fun consist um, of? I Is always, there? I mean, are you always just like... I'm always working. We took a vacation from Hawaii and I was like, we're not going to work. And we shot the entire time. Right. And I'm like, okay, next time we're not going to work though. So, I mean, I'm But it's always, also fun, right? It's so fun. Like, I, I just hang out with my family and my dogs. And... I don't go out, I don't party, I, I literally just work. My new thing is like my stunt training I'm doing right now. I'm like the wire, like so I'm with, i training with some of the people that did the John Wick movies. Like oh wow, the, again, again. Yes, so and is, so you, you do know, like the wire. Master P, Cher, <laughs> Snoop uh-huh, Dogg. Uh-huh. Uh, All these people, yeah, okay. everyone. He yeah. just knows people. Yeah. First, but she said, she goes, it's who you know. She's like, you know, I gotta meet people, you know, knows, I gotta, I gotta get dialed in, you know. <laughs> Oh, aside from masterpiece, aside Snoop, from share legend after legend after legend. Someone needs to just you know. She'll, yeah. fi- she'll figure it out, you know. Yeah, Along you're gonna figure it out. I don't know how it works. My life is work, I guess. <laughs> I like it. All right. Always work. Um, so, funny. what's the? Is there a? Is there a? Like I know you've got how many songs have you done now on this? Like is it an official like EP? Yeah, I did is a four it, song EP. And that's already and out. like four other singles. Yeah. And is that on iTunes and all that? iTunes, Apple, Spotify. Tidal. Oh, you posted a, a number on your Spotify stream. Do you remember yeah. the number? What, three. Uh, that's insane well, three too. three of my songs are over a million, yeah, which is pretty cool. Like that is crazy. So I have happy. 1,800 followers or whatever I have. It's like these easy. numbers are just crazy to me. Yeah. And you know what's crazy is a lot of women. My music, my obviously a lot of my Instagram stuff is mostly men, but my music is mostly women. That's actually great. I know. I'm like, okay. They and that eventually me. will probably flip your, not oh, maybe yeah. flip it, but oh, just yeah. level it up oh, yeah. a, a little bit. Oh, Do you yeah, know the yeah. percentage of men to women on your Instagram? To, I don't know the exact percentage, but I know it's like over 50 is like men for sure. But the people that don't follow me and look at my page, right. a lot, a little That's different so story. So technically, I feel like it's 50 50. Wow. You know. All right. <laughs> and then, when do you know when the next live performance is? It's going to be next month. I'm not sure what. It's going to be in the middle of the month. It's okay. Gonna be in LA. I have a question. If you were to randomly post on Instagram, like, hey, let's say you're in LA, I'm going to be on the at the IHOP on Santa Monica Boulevard in La Cienega at two o'clock today. How many people show up? Do you know? I like, don't. no. I'm so curious. To that stuff. Right, I get that. <laughs> but I'm not sure. I know uh, my uh, LA is my biggest city next to New right. York, so most. And of you essentially are in LA. did do that for the live performance, yeah. And it equated to three thousand people. And the thing people. I did here in Vegas, so yeah. Right. Like Pretty I always much. wonder, like what. Well, who happened. actually shows up? Yeah, like, like who I shows up? I hop right now. Right. It's funny. <laughs> I was me? I was actually telling Natalie before you got here that I remember um, as I was first getting to know you guys. Do you know what I'm gonna say? I remember like we went to like the Palm Steakhouse. I don't remember where we went. Like we went to a cool place, and then I remember you texting me, and you were like, "Hey, um, we just used to go to a Yard House. Like I'm a sweats and t-shirt kind of girl. Like you keep sending me these like menus of like." Let's oh, go to Mastro's. Let's go to <laughs> whatever. Where is that? Yeah. <laughs> this is too fancy. I need some just like, right. you know, like, pancakes. Yeah, you're like, I want IHOP. I want Yard House. Yeah, well, I, I want even to that one place are, every when now were, and then. When you were betting on the Connor show, it was like some breakfast spot. It was like buffet or something we went with all your friends. I forgot, but that place is really good. Yeah. 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 Here, here in Vegas? Breakfast is, yeah, breakfast is my, my jam. Oh, Palms. That was the Palms. Oh, was the Palms buffet. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. that's uh, legit. I it is. Oh, it's good. It's so good. It's good. All right, well, hey, this went quick. Yeah. I love we're it. Done it's too fast. We're, we're done already. It's over. It's too quick. It's too soon. I won't tell anyone how to follow you because they already, you've got the whole world <laughs> following you. Me. Yeah, I'm just, we're hoping we can piggyback off of you. Right, you know? exactly. Can we get a follower? <laughs> Maybe one, two, three. Lacey K. Three. Summers, thanks for spending time yeah, with the Vegas thank Junkies. You for of course, yeah. nice to meet you. So much fun. All right, we'll I'll see you guys back. next time. She'll be back. <laughs>